What's up guys and welcome to Nutero. I'm the energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the general reading for somebody. I have a massage. I have a massage. Um, somebody feels like you, okay. So there's somebody who's competing with you, but you're not competing with them. You're not even in the same building on the same planet in the same atmosphere. Like it's not and they're like, oh, yeah? Okay, well, I'm going to go do this. And, like, you don't even know what they're doing. And I don't feel like you care. But somebody's in competition with you. Invisible competition must be Scorpio. <laughs> it's funny, isn't it? Uh -huh. All right, anyway, what's up, Scorpio? Thank you so much for being here. I hope you guys are doing well today. Um, Nicole could be significant. Okay. Um, I'm going to pull from the tea leaf deck my astrology deck clarify and give you some advice he's a dweeb he's a loser that's all, all right anyway scorpio you could okay you could think somebody's a loser Bottom of the deck is kite vacation. Okay, some of you guys might be going on vacation soon here, or you should. Opportunities are waiting for you. Something is going to happen while you're on vacation. I feel like a door is going to be open to you, okay? For something, you have I psychic ability to trust your intuition. Yeah, I feel like your intuitions have already been telling you, like, hey, something's about to something's about to come. Something's about to come. And it might come while you're on vacation, okay? muddled thinking unclear and i also feel like um some of you guys don't know how this is gonna come but you just have a deep deep knowing that it's gonna happen it is gonna happen okay probably the the right the way that you thought it and said it and all of that but you just don't see it yet okay um for a lot of you too this is gonna come if it's not during vacation it's going to come really quickly like speedy speedy okay all right let's shuffle these um you could be eating bread and that's not good for you your body doesn't like it or the type of bread that you're eating is not um your body's not handling it well okay okay so the first set you have is bread candle and dog far away all right um distant friend is thinking of you you will be shown the way and period us prosperity and abundance all right so i feel like there's somebody if somebody passed away they're definitely in your energy at this time okay um this could be a dog as well or a pet um i feel like they're guiding you right now whoever this person is towards your prosperity towards your abundance oh you got two cards um if not this could be a, a literal friend okay or your spirit guides you have uranus and waxing gibbous moon okay so god of the sky in heaven Uranus is the power of awakening, which means that there will be some disruption and change, okay? And then you have perfection, mindfulness, and action. Make sure you are paying attention to all the details and staying mindful about what is happening both externally and internally. You got a lot going on right now. Your, in, your, your physical body could be going through stuff and your outside world is going through stuff at the same time. And that's why you have this guide here um protecting you right now and helping you i also feel like there is going to be some i'm getting strict change that you're going to have to experience either physically or um like with your physical environment or with your body what is um dog far away candle bread waxing gibbous moon and uranus you have the page of swords in reverse, the four of wands, the five of wands, and the wheel of fortune with the hermit. You could be dealing with a Virgo. Um, it's definitely fated and destined for there to be some type of um, competition or argument or some type of resistance between you and someone else. This is giving this is giving me commitment energy off the bat, okay? Um, I feel like there's arguing back and forth, some type of friction happening back and forth. That That's supposed to happen. So don't think that maybe, you know... Um, 
that maybe, you know, you should drop this. I don't feel like that. We're going to keep checking, but I don't feel like that. You have the page of swords in reverse. I feel like communication is not existent, or if it is, it's very little, okay? You guys are both spying on each other, though. Um, okay, the Hermit, the Eight of Cups, and the Two of Swords in reverse. Yeah, I feel like you. if you walked away from something, that, that was definitely meant to happen as well, because somebody needed to have some self-reflection self here. You know, I feel like you, I feel like you already know the way and somebody is making something that's already difficult more harder for you. You know what I'm saying? And you're definitely meant to walk away from that because it's like, you can't, this, you know, this is, this is a very tough process that you're going through and you need the support and the love that you need, not energy that is going to stress you out. So if you need to go on a hiatus real quick, do that with this hermit, Okay. Yeah, I, I feel like there's something that's going to be offered for you to you while you're on this hiatus or this person's going to come back. But I do feel like um, if you feel that you should be moving away from something right now emotionally and going within, do that. Okay, do that because you're being guided by you know your guides your um past loved one you know what i'm saying and there's a bigger purpose to this everything that's happening right now is definitely meant to happen we're gonna ask for the advice i don't feel like it's a throw it out the garbage i mean throw it in the garbage type of energy but i do feel like this was needed because there's there's a lot there's a lot that you're going through scorpio at this time you know what i'm saying what is tent, weeping willow, and bell? I mean, what is? This is what you got. Um, you have announcement, family sorrow, and temporary situation. So I feel like your living situation is about to change here. <clears throat> All right. And it's not going to make somebody in your family happy. You have full moon, clarity, manifestation, divination. Okay. I think we just. I'm not saying things. I'm, I, I, I don't have a. I'm not 100%. Uh, manifestation and adding extra power to your intentions this time this is the time to perfect okay i'm not reading all that we're not let's talk about like other stuff i don't do that i don't do spells and stuff like that so we're not gonna talk about that but um i do feel like this is coming in for you you've been manifesting this and it's coming in so don't don't not take it because people in your family are going to be upset about it you deserve this this is yours Maybe maybe you maybe you have to move to like California and you live in New York. So what? You know what I'm saying? You have the lover. Some of you guys might be moving with someone. <clears throat> the Knight of Cups, the Justice, the King of Wands. Like you're the Emperor, bro. You have all the right. You have all the right. The Justice is here. This is your good karma. You have all the right to move the way that you move in. This is beautiful here, especially if you're going with someone else or you guys are you're being guided to move with someone or towards someone. It's going to work out beautifully amazing. OK, the king of wands is here. This person is 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 like on your ass. <laughs> it could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, heavy on the Leo or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Gemini, um, Libra. You have um, three major arcanas, including this one. So. I feel like this is a big major change that's happening and it's a good change. It's really, really, really good. And I feel like this, it feels really, really good to you. So if anybody got anything else to say about that, Scorpio, bye Felicia, the tower. It, oh, look at this. The universe said, don't, you don't even got to tell Scorpio that because we not allowing nothing to come and mess up this for you. Okay. This is the cherry inverse. Could be a cancer, but it's like whatever is trying to stop you from going in this direction that the universe is trying to guide you to go is getting stopped in their tracks period because you are ready for this you're ready to take control of your life and you're ready to move on to this beautiful new chapter this is your good karma with the justice card okay so embrace that why did i go quickly through to yours everybody else is like 20 minutes i don't know maybe it's because i have a lot of water in my chart and like I can just f flow. I understand you guys. All right. You have throne, hat, and wedge. Also, we're ruled by the same planet because I'm an Aries, you know. Mars. Um, and you're ruled by Pluto too, but whatever. Mars was your first. Anyway, you'll be playing a different role, position of authority, and someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. 
all right so i feel like you're you're going to be playing a different role in your life you're going to be um if it's not a different role i feel like it's you're going to be in a different position in your life you might have more responsibilities you might you know your um your schedule might change this, this might be as small as your, your routines changing okay but this is good and i feel like some, somebody's trying to get in the middle of that you have leo could be a leo all right, you have creativity, passion, generosity, sincerity, fun, and humor. You can't let your failures define you. You have to let your failures teach you. The life will be what you make it. So rise like the sun and burn. So there could be somebody who you, whoever this person is that's trying to come between a situation, could be a Leo, it doesn't have to be though, but this could be somebody who you already, um, you know try something with and it didn't work out and now they could be trying they could be trying to stop something from working out for you you know what is hat thrown um yeah you're still gonna get it the two of cups yeah you're definitely gonna get it here um i feel like this could be a cancer pisces scorpio but the, whoever this person is they're just emotionally um triggered the king of cups in the verse is giving me emotionally triggered like i feel like you could be moving on i feel like you are you found someone you're loving on someone you know what i'm saying and um they're over here like the, like i feel like they're being judgy this page of wands and this queen of swords they're they're judging you they're like that's the person you want to be with you pick that person and it's like yes that's the person i want to be with and like forever what's up like <laughs> you know six of wands is here because you know it's gonna work out here okay i feel like there's something about it that looks different it looks different um to people or whatever now whoever this leo is all right this person's life now the issue now okay for some of you if this is this this could be an ex right an ex that is just bitter that you're moving on and happy with somebody else that you found somebody else that tickles your fancy or this could be somebody who is not has failed in their life they are not happy and they see you happy and living your best life and whatever and they're over here stuck in a miserable situation and they're just hating on you judging you like oh that that oh oh okay you know and it's like but if you look at their life they're miserable a lot of you guys know that this person is miserable a lot of you guys have saved this person um you spared this person because i feel like you could have put this person in their place real quick you know that's the thing about people don't know about scorpio like a scorpio knows everything but scorpio is not like a good um let me not say good that's crazy <laughs> there is no good or bad but um how, how can I say this? A Scorpio that's not operating from their ego, okay, knows to just take in information. Just take it. Just take it. And not try to throw it out, you know, throw it at people and, you know. But the thing is that you know, you know this person's life is in shambles. And, and they might be with this Leo energy, might be the type that to show the whole world that everything is Gucci and great. But deep down, it's not right or you know this could be an ex like i said whoever this is so it's like you gotta this person hating on your situation is tells you more about them than you okay and don't retaliate don't be petty you know what i'm saying because i feel like you you're making a good choice this could way this could be the way the universe is testing you like are you really going to commit to this person you know there could be people that are not with the shits you know what i'm saying um you could be dating a Leo and people are not with it. They're like, that Leo? That's You pick that Leo? You know, like, like whatever. However it works for you. But I feel like you're ready for this. And don't allow people to try to talk you out of something that you know you want. Okay. Okay. So I feel like you're moving in a way where others wish they could move. Maybe you and this person are about to, like, kill it. You know what I'm saying? And others wish that they could be in that spot. It could be too that whoever the person that is hating sees that you are truly happy, that you're not faking it. And they are, you know? Like, I feel like you're triggering somebody. And that's their freaking problem. Okay? It is. All right, let's get you some advice. 
Am I reading these? No. All right. What is um dog far away? Bread candle, waxing gibbous moon, and Uranus here. We have angel of balance. This could be a Sagittarius or a um Libra. I feel like the universe is telling you that this will be brought back to balance, okay? It will. You have the magician and the Mary. Yeah, this is giving me like patience. They want you to just be patient and keep manifesting when it comes to your abundance. That whatever this um, marriage or commitment thing is or this home situation, it will come together at the time that it's supposed to, okay? Angel of love, yeah. Especially this is a commitment. Like you guys, this is definitely a love that the angels want you guys both to experience so it, it, this ain't going nowhere it just right now it gotta be a little sticky okay what is full moon weeping willow tent and bell you have woman holding a heart okay so um i feel like the sex does not matter okay but this person is literally will will literally move all the earths and all they will literally move all the stars and all the clouds in a way where they arrange your name in the sky scorpio this person would do anything for you healer of the ages this person feels like you heal them this person feels like you are a healer this person feels like you all that in a bag of this person is holding you like look at this is your person, right? And this is you. And they're like, look, look at my Scorpio. Isn't my Scorpio amazing? Like, I feel this person is going gonna, is gonna to want to show you off. This person feels like you're very attractive, okay? And this move that you're making with this person is definitely a very good move. With the healer ages here, I feel like you guys are going to um, help others around you in some way. Okay? So again, whoever's upset... Go to the back. Go to the back. Okay, what is hat, wedge, throne, and sun, Leo? You have action, okay? So I feel the universe wants you to put in action to start making the moves with this person. Doesn't matter what anybody says, okay? And you have door to value. Yes, you could trust it. Yes, this is a valuable offer. Yes, okay? You have a woman holding a coin, yeah. Yeah, whatever this whatever this person is offering you, you should take it no matter what your family is saying because they don't know nothing. I'm sorry, but they don't. They don't wake up in your shoes every day. They don't know how it feels to be you, Scorpio. Only you know how you, you know what I'm saying? Only you know what's good for you, okay? All right, Scorpio, all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.